You know, uh, January, uh, we haven't announced this yet, but we're going to do our 115-pound belt. Excellent. Probably, yeah, we're probably going to do another uh, title match on that card. Um, you know, ideally, I would have liked to have done the 125, but we'll see how, uh, you know, Barb Honchek has fought uh, for us, I think, past two events. Mm hmm Right? Not three, I hope. <laughs> I maybe missed one. You know, sometimes an athlete, I think, does deserve and need a break. So we'll see where we kind of come in. But it's a good, you know, definitely um, Barb Honchek and Vanessa Porter will be fighting each other for the 125-pound belt as well. So we'll see if we're able to work that one in on uh, January with where they're at. Or, you know, we could jump, a, you know, a weight division and go to a different one. Maybe a 145-pound belt. Yeah, Barb Honchak, uh, you know, I was uh, incredibly impressed with her as well. And Vanessa Porto, that right hand was just like a tripwire. Uh, that will be a great fight at 125 pounds for the Invicta 125 title. So uh, that may happen in January, but uh, 115 is a definitely a go for January, you're telling me? Yeah, at this point, definitely, you know, that is definitely what we're looking at. Uh, and you're going to ask me this, and I'm never going to get this right because I always goof it up with uh, it's uh, the number one contender out of Japan. Versus Carla Esparza. Get in the cage with Bards. It's the closest you will get to MMA without getting into the ring. Join Carlin Bardsley on NSS Radio TV, where we want the talk, uncensored and unscripted.